The ACT Premium Contact Link Connection enables users of Outlook and ACT to quickly and easily identify Outlook email recipients as contacts in ACT, or to add new contacts to ACT directly from an Outlook email. Users can see past interactions with known email contacts directly from within Outlook, including activities and history items. ACT history records are created from communications in Outlook, with the text of the email being attached to all contact records. Additionally, users can create and schedule ACT to-dos with known contacts in the email. Here's how it works. First of all, you need an online Outlook account for this to work. I'm going to be using my free Outlook.com account just to demonstrate this connection. From the ACT Connect page, locate the ACT Premium Contact Link connection. And then in the box on the left, click the Get Started button. This page tells you all about the ACT Premium Contact Link. When you're ready, click the Install App button. What we want to do next is click the Add button here to continue. This will install the ACT Premium Contact Link to your Outlook account. To do that, we need to enter the email address for the account we're trying to connect. Click Next to search for it. And if you're not already logged in, at this point you'll need to log in to Office or Outlook by using your email address and password. As you can see, I'm already logged in. So, you'll be redirected to the Options Manage Add-ins page. From here, click the Install button. Outlook gives you a couple of instructions here. After you've read those, click OK. We can see now that the ACT Premium Contact link has been installed and it is currently turned on. So, let's go back to any current email that we have. I can see that I have a new email from Charlie Jones, so I'll click it to open it. Now, underneath the sender information, you should see the ACT Premium Contact add-in. Let's click this link. At this point, we need to log into ACT using our username, password, database, and the web server that we have on our installation. And then click Submit. At this point, you should see several options. First, there's a Quick Attach button. This will attach the email to the contact record in ACT. Next, there's a Schedule To Do. This will schedule a To Do activity with the contact in ACT. And last, you can click this button to add the contact to ACT. When you do that, you'll be able to record additional information such as company name, address, and so on. I'm going to click that now. For Charlie Jones, let's say that he works for a company called Magic Enterprises. And he's the CEO, and I can enter any other information that I want. Once I'm all set, I'll just click Save, and that will create the record in ACT. Now just to see that in action, I'm going to go back to ACT. I'm going to look at my contacts. I'm going to look up all contacts and go to the list view. And now I can see that Charlie Jones has been added to my contact list. So as you can see, connecting to Outlook from ACT Connect is easy and it keeps all of your contacts up to date.